it's me, Roxy G. So for today's video, I'll be showing to you guys how do I pack my prosecco teeth. So, yes, I've joined the craze. We raved and I rode the bandwagon of the pochette Matisse. So in case you're wondering how I ended up getting this bag, um, I'll put the link down below. So if you've already seen my what's in my bag video, you basically have um, a background of what I usually have in, inside my bag. And my pochette Matisse here is the new version, which doesn't have the leather tab and the slip pocket inside and you have noticed I removed the crossbody strap for my own convenience for this video and also I haven't removed the blue sticker since it's like my third or fourth fifth time of using this bag and I I'm kind of afraid of scratching it over my Bachetta handles getting so I'm gonna assume that majority of the uh, Push It Matisse owners are placing their phone on the back zip and I'm placing my Asus Zenfone 6 to the back zip which is like comparable to like iPhone 6 plus so let's pack this and beauty so first I'll be getting my um, bag organizer from my Retiro MM which I did what a video of what's in my bag. So I'll just get my organizer and transfer stuff to my pochette metis. So for the first compartment I, of my pochette metis, I'm planning to put um, some stuff from my Mark by Mark Jacobs cosmetic pouch, which is my sanitizer. And then my cologne from Jo Malone and then I think I'll downsize my lipstick from 4 to 2 and also I'll place it in the front pocket together with the sanitizer and the cologne and then I'll place um, wipes and my band-aid and also uh, I'll place my card holder and my credit card holder on the front and also a pack of lozenges. So this is what it looks like in the front pocket or the first compartment and then in the second compartment which is the biggest one I'll put my notebook and my Clemens wallet and also on top of that or if this will fit on the sides I'll put my condo keys so yeah that's inside it fits inside so here are the keys and that's my notebook and my wallet and then on the last compartment I'll put my bank essentials and my checkbook so that's it it's packed and ready to go so what's left in my organizer is the pouch that it came in with some trash and extra tissue my miniature perfume which i think i will be needing and my extra watch and just a couple of receipts and coupons that i won't be needing so i almost uh, transferred everything from my organizer to my pochette matisse and see uh, how compact and I believe uh, all my essentials are here and all things are complete for my daily activity. So if you may notice, um, even though I filled up my first compartment with lots of stuff and make it uneven inside, um, it doesn't give a obvious uh, bump and didn't uh, actually make a obvious crease of anything inside your bag. 
and also the back zip which some people tell that um, you're gonna notice like a bump if in case you fill the third compartment with some stuff and put your phone here um yeah it you can see there's like the shape of your my phone but on the side it's really not that obvious and it doesn't really stretch much the leather so that's it this is how i packed my lovely gorgeous and very convenient pochette motif so that's it for today don't forget to subscribe thumbs up and i'll see you in my next video bye